to my dear sister-in-law, Odi, that is her nickname, but she's called Barbara. Uh, I know you know that I'm the one who came to represent East Africa when we can we you are you to leave fruit away to collect away pandey. So I represented the, the East Africa community. To all the guests, young and small, big and what, to my aunt Elizabeth, who is the second follower of my mother, who is now 100 years old, and to everybody else who has taken his time or her time to come and help us mourn my brother, George Omore, on behalf of my family, I say karibuni. Na pamoja na hiyo nasema asante. Kabila sijaendelea na maneno. Nataka kuwashukuru watu wote ambao all the people who participated Kinara wetu mpendwa injini ya datari Raila Molo Odinga Na sasa niombe kwa hishma na taadhi makuu Wengine wetu tupate kuketi Ili kuruhusu ratiba kuendelea Endelea ndugu speech when um, Raila Amolo Odinga, the former Prime Minister, and my friend came in. My greetings to you, Udmun Bondo. I will now give a very brief speech on behalf of the Magoa family. As brief as the tail of a pig. Anus Mirabilis. There have been many scholars here who know what Anus Mirabilis means. When the Queen had a problem with Prince Diana and uh, Prince Charles, she sounded it by saying Anus Mirabilis. Translated means a very bad year. So we, the Magoa family, have had our annals, mirabilis. But since we believe in God, we thank God for giving us our brother and for the life he lived. So in short celebration, we are celebrating his life, not mourning. Because even if we mourn until all the tears fill the ocean, we shall not bring him back. Um, who am I to pay tribute to Magoa? And you people have done it. The scholars, the politicians, the ordinary people from Samburu, from Kajiado, they have all spoken well about my brother so there's no need for me to add anything if i have to give myself 10 marks i will only give myself that marks because i stayed with him during his primary education until his secondary education 
and I also helped him to bring his beautiful wife, who is now his widow. Um, one thing, you people who do not know Magoa, he has written a book, and that book has a lot. Why don't you buy it and read it? And this goes equally to my siblings. Most of you have not bought that book. You wanted to be given a complimentary like I was given, but you never got it. Instead of buying a whiskey, buy that book and read it. Just before he died, as has been mentioned here by Raphael, we were engaged in preparing the burial of his follower, Professor Richard Alexander Nyabera. We sat, he built for him his home because we had promised he had gone away without the law procedure. No woke a simba. So he went without establishing a home. So we had to establish one for him. Now George spent a lot of money doing that. But on the week before he died, we sat in my house, relatives only, and we agreed that we should give a contribution, a token contribution, towards bringing the body back, not for the house. And I, as the eldest, I was challenged. Um, I had to move my seat near him because I don't have very good ears. Then we spoke. Luckily, I had some money on my phone. I transferred it to his phone. I told him, now I've set the ball rolling. And then I got other members of the family, and they, they raised the money which he wanted. And that money was to be raised within 48 hours. That is the last thing that he did publicly with me. We had our lunch, and they went away. That was on a Fri Friday, Saturday. On Tuesday, I rang him, and I asked him, when exactly is the body arriving so that we can meet it? I realized he wasn't talking very well. So I asked him, what is the problem? I am not feeling very well. Uh, but I, I can manage. That is the last time we spoke. The next thing I heard from my wife the following day was that professor was gone. Do not be discouraged. Those of you who are here, uh, I'm now an old man. I've seen a lot. I saw my friend Agwings die, JM die. That has not stopped me from living. You have courage and work hard. Hakuna chabure. Munaskia. Well, the fourth president has told you many times, Hakuna Chabure. Lakini mukibujaribu mutapata. To my sisters, the two of them, and my brother Joseph, remain focused on what our mother's legacy, what George's legacy has been. Um, to everybody else, those who loved my brother, have peace. Pray for him. If he wronged you, forgive him. Please, I repeat, forgive him because nobody is perfect. Theo Wudinyasakwa, goodbye. Thank you very much. Uh, thank you very much, uh, my brother Obare. That was very well spoken. <laughs>